Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Breaking news out of New York City. This is not good. New York U.S. Immigration and Customs Enforcement (ICE) Enforcement and Removal Operations (ERO) in New York conducted a three-month review of detainers lodged with the New York City Police Department (NYPD) and New York Department of Corrections (MEDOC) to determine the type of criminal aliens who have been released from custody without ICE being notified. Detainers are ICE's request to a local law enforcement agency to notify ICE when an alien in custody will be released. Within the three months, from January to mid-April this year, ICE prepared more than 440 detainers against aliens booked by NYPD or NEDOC. Nearly 40 individuals who were released from custody, reoffended and were again arrested for crimes by local law enforcement officers. In just three months, more than three dozen criminal aliens were released from local custody. Simply put, the politics and rhetoric in this city are putting its own communities at an unnecessary risk said Scott Mekowski, acting field office director for the Euro New York. ICE has no choice but to continue to conduct at large arrests in local neighborhoods and at work sites, wasting valuable resources on criminal aliens who could be securely turned over to ICE custody at jails and prisons. However, ICE remains committed to its public safety mission and will continue to enforce our nation's immigration laws. Below are some examples of individuals arrested and released who reoffended within the three-month period, Black Square. A 43-year-old man from China was released in March after being arrested for criminal possession controlled substance 7th, then re-arrested for criminal possession controlled substance 5th, felony, in April. His criminal history also includes a conviction for criminal contempt, Black Square. A 28-year-old man from Azerbaijan was released in February after being returned on a warrant for a criminal trespass 3rd arrest from June 2017, then re-arrested in April for grand larceny 4th, credit card. His criminal history also includes convictions for assault third, disorderly conduct, and aggravated unlicensed operation of a motor vehicle first, Black Square, a 20-year-old from Guatemala arrested for a felony count assault second degree, injure victim 65 or older and released in January, arrested in February for felony grand larceny, and arrested again in March for resisting arrest. ICE has not been notified about the release of aliens in custody in New York City facilities since 2014 except for those that fall within the 170 crimes considered egregious by the mayor's office. Sanctuary policies, which have pushed ICE out of jails, force our officers to conduct more enforcement in the community, which poses increased risks for law enforcement and the public. It also increases the likelihood that ICE will encounter other illegal aliens who previously were not on our radar. For ICE, it makes more sense to devote resources to jails to solely focus on criminals reducing the broader enforcement efforts and allowing the apprehension of individuals with the secure confines of local jails. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.